Use my hands when I start my windup are usually about chest high, level high, just so I keep my hands at a steady position during my windup. A lot of guys have trouble with, you know, they, they have their glove down here and then they start and then they bring their hands up and then when they come, they just, it's a whole messy situation that you don't really want to be involved in. So I just like, I just like keeping my hands right by my chest the whole time through my whole motion. And so it's just, just an easy motion, no hassle, no nothing, nothing uh, can go wrong. So I just like keep my, keep my hands right here the whole time and just go through my windup. See how easy it that is, it's just, there's nothing, nothing to do. Just keep your hands at a nice steady position, nice and easy, and then go through your windup. I like last, lastly, is the, the follow through again. Like I said, there was a $20 bill at the end of there. A lot of guys, it's a key factor is uh, to follow your windup, follow it off with, uh, with that because a lot of guys, they tend to stand straight up at the end of their at the end of the windup, and that causes the ball to go who who knows where. So it's a good good idea to just make sure you follow through at the end of your windup, just like that. So the ball goes where you tend it to be. A lot of guys they they come up like this, and then just just the body straight up, and that's that's not good. No, no thing I forgot to mention is when. When you're going through your motion, you know, nice easy step. Make sure your foot's aligned with the rubber. Leg up like this, nice and balanced over the mound. When you come down, make sure you point your glove at your target. Because sometimes guys don't really point the glove at the target and they just, they just kind of let it drag down by their knees and all that stuff. Basically, when this, this glove is your target finder along with your eyes. So when you're going through your, your windup, you want to point that glove along with your eyes right at your target. And then when you, when you throw it, you want to bring it back at your chest. And just in case a line drive comes, comes back at you, you're ready, have it right here, ready to, ready to catch it. A lot of guys, they, they come like this and they spring their glove all the way back here. And, and then when the line drive comes back at you, what are you going to use to block your face? And you just hopefully have a good reaction time. But, now I'm just, I want to put it all together for you here. Like I said, I have my feet angled by the third baseline, so it's just a nice easy step for me. My gloves at my chest here. I take my nice easy step, make sure my foot's along with the rubber, bring my leg up. When my leg comes down, my hands come along with it. I'm at the top, my arms at the top of my motion. And when I throw gloves back in my chest and I follow through, here real quick and I'll ask my motion. I'll put it together here real quick. You know, there's no need to rush through your windup at all. It's, you know, it's not a race. You're the one, the pitcher's controlling the game right now. So, you know, between every pitch, just take a nice breath, get back up there, and just make sure you're ready for the pitch. Take a breath and, and go. And it's just nice and easy like that. And then next time, Make sure it's the same every time. You now get up there, nice and easy. Like talked about, staying over the over the mound. You Notice how my body weight is kind of is kind of back over my right leg. Just like when I come up, I kind of lean back a little bit, just so my body and my height is over is over the mound. A lot of guys, they rush to the mound. They're all fast like this. And then they just, they don't have any, they don't use their weight, their height. A lot of it, a lot of guys just throw with their arms. You need your whole, whole body, your legs, your torque, your everything to, uh, to pitch. And it's just, it's just not your arm. A lot of guys think that. It's your whole body, your legs, abs, everything. So I just like, notice how I stay over the mound and kind of just even lean back a little bit when I pitch. I'll show you just one more. It's nice, fluid, easy motion. No need to rush. And 
and that's that. It's uh, just remember, like I said before, it's it's not a rush. You know, it's it's nice, easy, fluid motion. It just doesn't need to be any anything spectacular in there. And uh, and uh, my name is Mike Fulton Levich, and thanks for watching my video.